Good afternoon, my friends. Hope you all are doing well today. Today I am going to review some rice cakes because every now and then we have to have some crunch in our life. So if I'm looking for that crunch factor, let's start with corn cakes. With a touch of sea salt, these are very thin, 110 calories, 25 on the carbs, zero on the sugars, and two grams of protein. And that's for five cakes. I would never eat five cakes. Maybe I would eat one. So cut those carbs back to like five grams because I'm only eating one. Maybe 10 if you're eating two coming in at 110 calories. Let's see what they taste like. So they're corn cakes, not rice cakes. Not bad. Little bit taste of salt. Tastes just like a normal rice cake. If I was hungry for a potato chip, that would do the trick for me. Next, we are going to try Corn Thins, organic sesame flavor. These, for three of them, it's 70 calories, with 13 on the carbs, one on the fiber, so that would be 12 on the carbs, no sugar, and two grams of protein. Again, I'm not going to eat three of these. Maybe I would eat one. This one says it's sesame flavored. I don't really taste the sesame. Me personally, I'd probably put some whipped cream cheese on and sprinkle my everything bagel seasoning on here. These are pretty good though. Coming in three slices at 70 calories. Again, I'd probably only eat one, one maybe two, so you're talking only maybe four carbs. That's a good snack. Then we have over here my favorite ones. The Quaker rice cakes. I've never tried the everything ones. We're going to give that a shot. But one cake is 50 calories with nine carbs, zero sugars, and less than one gram of protein. So the corn cakes over here have some a little bit of protein in. These, not so much, but these have the very good taste. So let's give it a try. Mm. Now these, you definitely have a taste, like a very salty, like everything bagel type seasoning, but ground up. Those are pretty good. I don't know that I would say that I can taste like the everything bagel seasoning. By everything, I don't really know what they mean, but they are good. Then you have my favorite. When I'm looking for a treat, this is usually one of my go-tos, the chocolate ones. One of those is 60 calories, 12 on the carbs, four on the sugars, and one on the protein, which if I'm looking for something sweet, this is my favorite, chocolate ones. Mm. And then, if you wanna go really totally crazy and put a little bit of peanut butter on here, it's amazing. So, and last but not least, I have a new one to try which it's element and these are dipped in milk chocolate one cake is 80 calories with 10 carbs five sugars and one gram of protein these are completely dipped in sugar on the one side so they're thin not as thick as the Quaker ones 
Mm. Oh, that's very good. That's like eating like a candy bar with Rice Krispies in it. Rice Krispie chocolate. Very good. It's very good, but it's more candy-like. I do like the Quaker ones, chocolate. But for a treat, I would try these out. If you could find them, that's not bad. So, that's what I have to say about rice cakes and corn cakes. And they're not bad. And, now I guess I have to go do some laundry for the rest of the day. But, I hope this video finds you guys all doing well. And again, I'll see you guys tonight at 8 for protein bars. Have a great day.